when the looks fade he will dump her simple as that so hey guys hope you are doing good i am doing good too and welcome to yet another reaction video uh, in this video i will react to an article that was published a bit long ago one of my friend gave me that article and told me to tell me my opinion on this article i will put the link in the description below uh, but i will read in short what happened in this article deepak the most proven dating coach in the world so there is a girl in new york and she put an ad in craigslist and she is looking specifically for a guy who is earning 500k or more annually and she want to marry him she's saying i'm beautiful i'm articulate and classy uh, i'm not from new york i'm looking to get married to a guy who makes half a million a year so i know how that sound but keep in mind that a million a year is middle class in new york city so i don't think i'm overreacting at all then she's saying are there any guys who make 500k or more on this board any wives could you send me some tips i dated a businessman who makes average around 200 to 250k but that's where i seems to hit a roadblock 250k won't get me to central park west i know a woman in my yoga class who was married to an investment banker and lives in tribisia or tribica i don't know how you pronounce it and she is not as pretty as i am and now she is great genius so what she is doing right how do i get to her level then she is asking some questions like where do you single rich men hang out give me specific bars restaurants gym what are you looking for in a mate be honest guys you won't hurt my feelings is there any age range i should be targeting i am 25 then she asked some more uh, materialistic irrelevant questions you can read that article later also so so in my opinion this girl is a gold digger she is thinking very high of herself and uh, and she is also a narcissist maybe she is not deserving a, that rich guy but she think that she deserve that guy in other way if she is writing that question then it means that she has tried and she is not deserving that guy then there was a guy who replied to her query so uh, this is how he replied i read your post with a great interest and have a thought meaningfully about your dilemma I offer the following analysis of your predicament first i am not wasting your time i qualify as a guy who fits your bill that is i make more than 500k plus a year that said this is how i see so you offer from the perspective of a guy like me is plain and simple a crappy business deal here is why cutting through all the bs what you suggest is a simple trade you bring your looks to the party and i bring my money fine simple but here is the rub your looks will fade and my money will likely continue into perpetuity in fact it is very likely that my income increases but it's also an absolute certainty that you won't be getting any beautiful which is also correct so what is saying is simple that as the time will pass uh, whatever he is earning now maybe he is earning like 500k maybe after 5 years maybe he is making 750k or maybe 1 million 1 million like you know uh, per year but after 5 years from now uh, this girl is she's 25 and when she become 30 she won't be looking that beautiful what she is looking now so her beauty will definitely fades away and that's the only thing she is bringing to the table her looks so in economics term you are a depreciating asset and i am an earning asset not only you are depreciating asset your depreciation accelerates let me explain you are 25 now and will likely to stay pretty hot for next 5 years but less so each year then the fate begins in earnest by 35 stick a fork into you so in wall street term we call you a trading position not a buy and hold and hence the rub marriage it doesn't make you it doesn't make good business sense to buy you which is what you are asking so she is asking for marriage and here he is saying like buying is like a marriage so i would rather lease so when he say lease i would rather lease means that uh, he would rather date date this girl not marriage he would rather date this girl 
So I would rather lease in case you think I'm being cruel, I would say the following. If my money were to go away, so would you. So he's saying that like uh, maybe she think that, oh, like, you know, she, he will not marry, but he's asking for lease or date. Then he's saying that, like, you know, if I lose my money because money is the only thing she is, she, she, she interest. She, she don't care about other things. She care about money only, gold digger. So if the money goes away, she will also go away. So as simple as that. So if my money were to go away, so would you. So when your beauty fades, I need an out. It's as simple as that. So a deal that makes sense is dating, not marriage. That's what he's saying. And he's saying quite right because this girl is a gold digger and uh, she only look for, uh, for money and she don't care about other things. Uh, she only care about money and don't care about any other thing. And uh, if the money goes, she will also go. She will look for other guy. So he's saying at the, at the same time, um, after five years or 10 years, she will also become older and her looks fade away. Then he's saying like, you know, then when the looks fade away, then he will look for another girl because it's based on like, you know, she's bringing the looks and he's bringing the money. So when she's getting older, when she become uglier, then he need to have a way to get out of relationship. And if he's doing marriage, then he cannot get out of that relationship. So it's better to date these kind of girls only. Separately, I was taught early in my career about efficient markets. So I wonder why a girl as articulate, classy and spectacularly beautiful as you has been unable to find your sugar daddy. I find it hard to believe. If you are as gorgeous as you say you are, then 500k hasn't found you, if not only for a tryout. By the way, you could always find a way to make your own money. Then we wouldn't need to have this difficult conversation. With all that said, I must say you are going about in the right way. Classic pump and dump. I hope this help. And if you want to enter into some sort of lease, let me know. So you can read the full article later. I have put the, I will put the link in the description. So what he's saying, the only good deal that can happen between the guy like that and the girl like this gold rigger, digger is uh, some kind of lease, like what we say, pump and dump. Like um, she's bringing the looks, he's bringing the money and they have good time, they date. And then when the looks fade, he will dump her. Simple as that. So he is giving a right answer. This is how it is. I'm agree to that also. Many of you guys are earning financially really, really good and uh, doing a good job, good business. So watch, watch out for these kind of girls, these kind of gold diggers. They only go for your money. That's it. They only go for your money and the money fades away they will also leave you. And uh, one thing to detect these kind of girls and to filter out these kind of girl is also if you have a good game, good understanding of women, if you have a good game, if you can attract, like for example, more girls, more quality girls in your life, then when you have more options, then you can easily filter out these kind of girls. For example, if you have only only one option, you, you find this girl and the girl is gold digger, digger and you have only one option now, then you will try to compromise and, and will like, you know, go into that relation uh, because you don't have any other option. But you have if you have game and you are able to attract lot of uh, attractive girls, then you can easily filter out like shitty girls or the girl who only look for your money. Then you can filter them out very easily. I will suggest you not even to go in like, you know, kind of other dating relationship at all. Forget about marriage. I will not suggest you even to go in other relationship like, you know, non-marriage relationship. Uh, because it's, it's a lot of headache. And uh, learn, better learn. Uh, a good game so that you can attract lot of high quality girls in your life and then you can filter out the like you know the low quality girls the gold diggers the damaged girls and then only date the quality girls who like you for who you are who respect you for who you are 
So learn the game. For you guys only, I'm making an online product, Dating Mastery, and that will definitely help you in improving your game, learning tight level of game so that you can have lot of quality girls in your life. You can attract lot of quality girls in your life. Uh, the product is going to be released in few months. So stay tuned. And if you are enjoying my content, then like this video, subscribe to this channel and hit that bell button. And also in the comment section, uh, please let me know what you think about this video, what you think about this article, uh, about the gold digger girls, what are your thoughts on that? Uh, have you experienced some kind of girls in your life? I also want to know your experience and also uh, write in the comment section what type of content you want to want me to produce in this channel in future so guys stay away from gold diggers learn a tight game and we will see you in the next video take care bye